Hey guys, it's Brendan Borman back for another exciting 270 video. It's a Thanksgiving edition. It is myself, the big turkey, taking on my dad, playing as Santa Claus with a Martin Luther King Jr. vice presidential candidate. So he's going to open up, it looks like, contesting me in the Old South. For those of you who are wondering, my dad has been playing for a while. He is not active in the tournaments. He did play in my YouTube subscribers only tournament. He was on Team Siraj, um, but unfortunately lost to Richard Gad in his one and only streamed match. Um, but he does play maybe five or ten games a month, just kind of more for fun. But anyway, it's pretty cool. I get to play against my dad. Um, he had never seen this turkey candidate before, so he um, wanted me to be independent Bernie, so he had a chance is what he said. All good. Well, I'm going to make a run here at the Old South. I'm going to overspend a little bit in Georgia just to make sure I get that bonus, and then I'm going to save 131000 And my dad did open up into Florida, which may give him a slight advantage for swing states or for an African-American push, although if I get that Old South, then maybe um, I can use that to my advantage. However, my dad also pips up double pipping into New York. So um, I'm going to contest these African-American states, and I'm going to flip Virginia with my old South money. And I need to get into some more states. So let me go into Arizona, and then might be a waste for New Mexico, but... Um, kind of a fallback plan if I have to save money save money save money and then double double tip um, California and New Mexico I can always pip up into or California and Texas I can take New Mexico for Latino if I lose Illinois or if I'm able to steal Florida with Florida North Carolina Virginia Arizona and New Mexico that's a swing state bonus so just give me some options for later for just 15,000 um, I'm going to make a play at African American. I don't think I'm going to get it. Um, I'm assuming, yeah, so I lose Alabama. So I just want to see. We do flip Maryland by a pip and North Carolina by a pip. But Virginia goes back to Santa Claus. So it's 123 to 96. Turn number six, I'm the only one with a bonus. I do have the Old South bonus, which is not insignificant, but... It's not game-changing if I am not able to get this AA bonus. So I'm going to take a risk here. I'm going to not close Virginia. I think my dad will close Virginia. I'm going to flip Alabama back and then defend Maryland by a pip and North Carolina by a pip. But it looks like Santa Claus has low, low spent. And... Man, now I've got the Old South. Okay, so that seems obvious to try to steal that. Um, I'm not in Michigan. Okay, so that was my mistake. I should have been in Michigan because I think if he just has what he has with – so he flips North Carolina. Oh, man. Okay, so that's going to be the AA bonus for Santa Claus. So one point, my dad – zero points for the big turkey um so i'm gonna close off alabama maybe he'll get frisky and try to steal that state and then now i'm kind of in the position of i need to chase so i'm gonna one pip new york he might spend big here in florida Didn't spend any in Florida. Okay, so interesting. Okay, so I can one pit past him in New York. Seems like a not a good investment. <laughs> um Gonna just use my old South money in Maryland. No clash. There's the defense in New York. He does open up in Pennsylvania, which is smart. Good for my dad. He's gonna try to get the swing state bonus. He didn't need um, all of Pennsylvania. He could have gone, you know, Wisconsin. However, 
He already has Michigan and Virginia. I mean, he's really working toward that high-tech bonus. So um, I'm going to open up in Iowa and New Hampshire to possibly give myself town again if I am able to steal um, New York here, which I do. So that does flip the African-American bonus. However, we had to spend a lot of pure cash, so it's more even than it looks. But I can go, and go ahead and get town and gown, and I expect my dad to get swing states on this next turn. Florida's is probably his the rest of the game. He's on the ninth pip. Trying to use the old South money in Maryland and not AA, but oh well. I'll just save this turn. He did low spin. He's chasing me in town and gown. But instead of defending, I'm going to open up in Massachusetts. And I'm still not facing pressure in Arizona. So even if I lose it for a turn, I'll be okay. I don't need to spin in New York because he's got 540000 and 114 of it is swing state money. But I'm thinking about maybe some states I could defend with my AA. Illinois will be good. I could try to steal Michigan. But it's still really risky. I'm going to save my AA. And I'm going to double pip Texas. As well as open up into a couple oil and gas states. North Dakota is a town and gown state. So in case I lose a couple town and gown states, I can always use that. Michigan was closed off, so good thing I did not do that. New Hampshire does flip. So he used his swing state money there. So he still has quite a bit of pure cash. Um, now I need to defend Arizona for sure. AA in town and gown. I can't get the um, oil and gas bonus this turn, but I can open up into some new states. And we'll see what Santa Claus does. He does make a attempt at Arizona, which is going to cost him. That was a lot of cash. He flips Georgia. Wow. Was he making a play for AA? Looks like it, but he needed he needed a few more states. But Arizona would have helped him quite a bit. I think his play would have maybe not to defend Michigan. Maybe leave it open. Okay, so we're really in the driver's seat now. Um, I'm going to get the manufacturing bonus. I'm going to get the oil and gas bonus. We are facing pressure in all the right states. Louisiana, Illinois, Colorado. But I'm feeling a lot better about this game now than I was maybe five minutes ago. Now that we have six bonuses, really we just can't lose New York. Going to close off a lot of these states. Illinois, which is the Latino tipping point. Um, I do need to close off um, Arizona as well. And then I've got, I've got Town & Gown for that. Um, Export and Ag are still outstanding as well as High Tech. So Colorado flips. I 
However, I do get New Mexico back. So that's 225. This is a longer game. I've been playing a lot of long games lately. I don't know if it's because of the AA battle and lots of clashes or just the lack of entry into states. But um, increasingly more and more, my games are less reliant on Texas and California. And that can be a good thing or a bad thing. I've had some pretty, pretty notable losses in several tournaments this week. One game in particular, I lost to Patrick Ghost, um, who's a up and coming player. Um, and I think the game went like 24 turns or something crazy. Um, Dennis Muxlow, who I also play in a Survivor Challenge hosted by Renee Lopez. Um, Dennis and I, now we did clash in uh, women's movement or, or a national group for like 20 turns, but then we also had a stalemate in Texas. That lasted over 50 turns. Pretty crazy. Um, I'm not going to take any chances. I'm going to go ahead and close off New York. And then um, I'm kind of being not a little bit mean, but I'm, I'm hoarding a bunch of cash here just to make him sweat a little bit. I'm sure he'll give me a, a call after this game. How'd you get so much money? It's not fair. <laughs> but... Um, there's not really anywhere to use my AA bonus, so that's unfortunate. He's closing off a couple states. Iowa was good because I have um, Town and Gown. He has swing, so he might as well use that. Just in case there was a ballot push, I entered into a lot of states. He was already there. And that is turn number 17. He does get the high tech bonus, so good on him. Okay, so I'm saving my Latino. Um, I just was want to one pip up into New into California to chase him. Just put some pressure on. Just a couple states. Um, you know what? I might I might put him out of this misery here. I might just one pip these states just in case he doesn't. Maybe go for a ballot. I have two ninety five in AA. I have. Um, almost 200k in Latino. Um, what might be really funny is if I can go for Florida on the ballot. You know, I'm gonna almost do a pump fake. I'm gonna enter into California. He's probably gonna defend big because he doesn't want to lose <laughs> flip Massachusetts. That's funny. He's not gonna want to lose California, and he's not gonna see <laughs> Florida coming. So, let's go for that. Um, at this point, 306 to 232. He did not enter those states. We have a ballot, so I'm. Guaranteed to win. <laughs> this will be so funny if it works. Okay. So I am going to defend the states that I am have a soft lead of just one pip by. Um, putting a second pip in those states. And after that, I'll see how much money I have. Defend a couple states here. Okay, flipping Ohio and Pennsylvania by one, that probably won't work, but eh, all good. Florida. Oh, it worked. <laughs> oh, gobble, 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 gobble. Lots of clashes. Well, good game, Dad. It was a pleasure to play against you. Um, don't see that Santa Claus, Martin Luther King combination very often. But I know Thanksgiving's a little bit different this year, not having Thanksgiving dinners and COVID-19 and having to quarantine, all that good stuff, social distancing. But I'm glad we were able to play a game of 270. And um, he didn't want me to put it on YouTube, but you know, he's not a bad player. Um, he's If you happen to run into him in the lounge, um, Make sure you uh, send me a message if he, if he happens to beat you so I can give him some kudos. Anyway, thanks, Dad. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. And until next time, I will catch you guys in the next video.